PAL Fab was established in 1977, initially only manufacturing timber pallets. Since then, through understanding the importance of softwood as a valuable renewable resource, PALFAB has become one of Ireland's largest suppliers of sawn softwood products for use in the construction, pallet, packaging, fencing and garden accessory industries. In addition to producing their own sawn products, they also import part processed timber from Scandinavia, Russia, the Baltic States and mainland Europe. PALFAB's growth strategy is based around its focus on research and development into new high-value products and processes. State-of-the-art production facilities enable a high degree of product flexibility and production to the highest quality standards. The primary raw material for the clean wood process is pre-shredded recycled timber. This wood is sourced from recycling yards such as this one. Once shredded, it is transported in bulk to the air block facility. Okay, we've manually separated out the various constituents contained in the sample from the Aeroblock shredded wood intake. The first separation here is ceramic material and it contains stones, grit and glass. The next separation is ferrous material which is normally made up of steel and iron. The third fraction we have here is non-ferrous material which normally is constituted uh, from aluminium, brass. And in this fraction it's normally plastic based. We have plastic paper, um, bits of various other plastics and some sponge. However, the main constituent is made up of wood chip of various sizes. And in order <coughs> to separate the wood chip from these materials, what we have done is we have designed a series of machines and processes with two companies from uh, Italy, Email and PAL, and we've installed the equipment in the Aeroblock. This system is based on video color recognition and we call it the Cleanwood Vision System. Airblock is PALFAB's partner in the Clean Wood project. Situated adjacent to PALFAB, Airblock is a brand new state-of-the-art facility. The cleaning of the wood takes place here, on site. Once delivered, the material is taken by loading shovel to the moving floor. From here, the material is conveyed up to a Dyna screen, which separates the material into three different sizes. The largest size is 60 millimeters or greater. 
This larger material is conveyed to a water bath which separates the wood from heavier items such as metal, stones and grit which sink to the bottom. The remaining wood is then conveyed to a chipping machine where it is reduced in size to under 50 millimeters. Leftover residue is sent to a skip from where it is sent to landfill for disposal. The next size, between 8 and 60 millimetres, passes through two magnetic drums to remove any ferrous metals. The material then goes through an eddy current separator to remove non-ferrous metals. The wood then goes through a density separator, which operates on a principle of vibration and air agitation. Here, the stones and other heavy materials fall to the side before the wood is conveyed to a water bath for further cleaning. The smallest size to go through the Dynascreen is anything under 8 mm. This material is taken to a wind sifter where the sand, grit, stones and pieces of metal are removed. All leftover residue is sent to landfill for disposal. Ferrous and non-ferrous metals are bulk bagged, then sent to a metal recycler. The aim of the Cleanwood project is to ensure that the wood that we end up with is completely clean and is suitable for use as a boiler fuel or maybe animal bedding. So we have to ensure that that, that wood is completely clean. To ensure that we get clean wood, we are on the side of caution and we tend to remove uh, a small quantity of clean wood uh, with the contaminants. As we've been progressing the, the system, we've improved its ability to, to differentiate between wood and bed chip. This means the overall yield is continuously improving. The EU Life Programme was instrumental in the launching of uh, Aeroblock. It helped Aeroblock to get over the initial starting phase the research and development and the commissioning of the plant. Airblock is a new state-of-the-art facility which is using 100,000 tonnes of recycled wood chip. It's taking that material away from landfill and producing products. Composite pallet blocks are exported Europe-wide to the pallet industry. Animal bedding and wood chip for boilers. Without the EU life funding, Airblock would have found it very difficult to get over the startup phase. Mm -hmm.